is yet unborn, for the swirling images that flow forth from the chrysalis are only a shadow of the sleeper's true power. The psionic emanations of the chrysalis have reached out into the depths of space and lured our enemies to us. Even now, we are aware of their plans. <sighs> the Terran forces with care. Your priority is to protect the Chrysalis at all costs. And welcome back everyone to StarCraft. Okay, so we gotta protect the Chrysalis and we also gotta fight uh, General Duke's boys. The only real tough part about this mission is that they have siege tanks. Other than that, this mission's not too terribly bad, so... It'll be a little war of attrition here and there. Ooh, crap. A lot more Marines there than I thought there would be. Right, should be able to take them out with this group here. I just gotta send my Hydralisks in first, because they can take a better beating than my Mutas. Muta wings! The problem is my freaking hydralisk are slow. Good enough. That's just to clear that up so I can, you know, just jump right on it. That's what she said. So that. I did a little bit more experimenting with uh, the original Command and Conquer for the the uh, cutscenes. I, I honestly cannot get it to work, so I, I don't know how it's gonna work. Cause um the I, I mean, cause you don't even know what the hell's going on. You just know that I'm doing these various missions of blow this up for that reason, or blow that up for this reason, etc., etc. I mean, the gameplay is running smoothly. You know, I'm not getting the random slowdown bits like how I am with uh, StarCraft here, but meh. I don't know. I probably should have just waited and edited edited it to where the uh, cutscenes would just kind of play here and there, like before each mission. Basically, what I mean by that is uh, record it from the actual game itself. Those stones don't really hurt that bad. Those marines, on the other hand, they hit like trucks, which is kind of puzzling to me. Blue, oh, I was going to say blue. I don't remember there being blue people in this. Now I got the song, uh, Blue by the Bira Lula. Ah, that sounded close enough. I got that song playing in my head now. Word the Furk. Also, I have a new desktop background. It's actually the Ginyu Force from Dragon Ball Z. So, <laughs> if we uh, end up accidentally seeing my background, like how we did in uh, Red Alert 2, yeah, you won't see the creepy Arthas and the Japanese, the Japanese-looking girl in the background. It'll be crap. Fall back, little guy. Never mind. Just, you know, explode in a blood pool or whatever. Okay, I got all my drones I need for my gas gathering. Gathering gas. Gas. Wow. Gas is. Can't even speak today. It's my one day off, too, because we're in the middle of that crap related to my work. On the plus side, though, it's only three days left, and then everything's back to normal. Ooh, and I get a three-day weekend, or four-day weekend, actually. Like a sunken colony. Get two more drones. That is the one downfall to the Zerg, is that you have to make a drone for just about every building you make, so you're actually paying... Let's say a building costs 50 minerals, you're actually paying 100 for it, because you got to buy the drone to make the building. That is one of the drawbacks to the Zerg, if you think about it. I 
I was actually gonna originally make a... Actually, I needed to get this anyways. Another hatchery here. Should be able to plop one there. No, no, because the minerals are there. Curses. Plop one there then. Okay, got a little bit of a defense here. You. I can make. Yeah, I can make layers in this, so let's get a second evolution chamber so we can make our upgrades a little bit quicker. But I guess thinking about it alternatively, the Zerg do only have uh, five types of upgrades as opposed to the Terran that have six. So I guess, in a way, you're saving money in some places. Okay, let's get some Zerglings. Get some Zerglings! And the the uh, gist of this mission of what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a lot of hit and runs with mutalisks. And then... Because what I want to do is take out as many siege tanks as I can. Because if you just send your guys, you know, head on in. Or he yeah, headlong in. Then you basically just get wiped the flip out. Like, you saw how I was with my siege tanks. And I was only using, like, a couple per, like, little entryway. And, you know, I was holding them back every which way you looked at it. So... The computer is actually worse with theirs. Holy shit, that's a lot of guys. Building took a little bit of a beating there. More zerglings, damn it. Also gonna need to get an overlord. Um I'll increase their range here in a bit. Actually, now I'm looking at it. I could probably go with making another uh, drone for gas harvesting. So I'll do that. I wish there was a way you can make like your guys, like you have the burrow ability, which I have not used once yet. But I wish there was a way you could like burrow them, but make it to where they automatically unburrow when an enemy gets nearby. That would be awesome. And when they're burrowed, nothing can see them unless it's like a detector, like the Overlord or the missile turrets. Or the observers. Oh, and just wait till we get to, uh, they're not detectors, so it's a little off topic, but wait till we get to the scarabs. If you don't know what you're doing, those things can be a nightmare. So there will be a few missions where we fight the Protoss, and even when we're playing as the Protoss, we obviously fight against the Protoss at one point, but I'll get into that later. Scarabs are nightmares. That's it, that, they are my prime weakness, I would say, when it comes to fighting against the Protoss. I mean, I know there's like easy ways to deal with them. Um, Mutalisk has been the one that I've been kind of having. Like, I kind of use Mutalisk in combination with my other defenses. Oh, hold on a minute. There's no. Wow. Oh, yeah, it's because that terrain is considered unbuildable. Coises. Let's get these guys up here. Get a couple of those. Which I may as well get the burrow ability and have like a couple of guys burrowed here and there. That way, you know, kind of have a little bit of line of sight. Kill him, he's gonna get in the way. Plus, I'm the Zerg, that's what I do, I kill people. Because I'm evil, bitches! Ugh, I hate that sound. Probably the one sound of all the Zerg buildings that just kind of makes me, you know, like shudder, like, ugh. Yeah, I'm gonna go 
I can get a few drones. Spawn more overlords. You two up here. Ah, uh, hi. Congregated at wait, where the hell are my other overlords? Oh, they're over here. Let's go ahead and poop out two more. Okay, we'll upgrade this into a lair. Okay, two enough. Two is good enough. Getting me some mutalisks. Wish I could go with having a sunken colony or two here. Just for a little bit of support. Oh, right, I got my burrow ability now. So, provided they don't like use reveal, which I doubt they will, because I can't make any mobile uh, guys. That can detect, so my Zerglin should be safe. I'll probably get one right here. Okay, maybe not. Jerks. You're all a bunch of evil bitches. And you smell funny. Back up here. You make me a. I'll make one right here. And I'll have you two start getting into the gas. Make two more. Poor Zerglings. Okay, and then we can basically get stuff for overlords because they also act as our transports. So again, I guess that's another way that you can save money by switching your car insurance to Geico. I mean, by playing as the Zerg. Wow, what am I on about? And many Zerglings were born that day. Let's get a Spire. Which I think I'm just going to function off one. Get two more drones up here. Crank out of crap on overlords. Just to keep my spline check. We must make more overlords. More, I say. And then I'll start working towards getting me some mutas. Some muta wings. And I am referencing StarCraft 2 there, but I'm sure most of you already knew that. Oh, here they come. Hey, oi, oi. Alright, follow me. One Hydralisk. Okay, I'm gonna, I could use with I could go with making a second one, I'm plopping it right there. Get more hydralisks up here. We need more zergling replacements. I'll send you guys up here. Um, 
Let's get that. And we'll get that. We'll get three mutas. Actually, we can get with four. Attack the critter! Man, critter took a beating. Alright, so there was a siege tank right there I remember seeing, so I'll hit that guy. Sunken colony. Actually, where's that one drone that got attacked? Oh, he must have not gotten hit very hard then. He's already healed up. Right, three more. You gotta make every one of them count. Because right now, that expansion base I have up there and this right here are all the resources I got. But I don't think I've really touched this mineral bit yet, have I? Hmm. Yeah. Play smart with my economy, I should be okay. And we'll make two more and then we'll do our first hit and run. Go ahead and get that. Okay, so all of our, all of our Zerglings and Hydralis have gotten all their bonus upgrades. Alright, could go with upgrading my Overlords. Okay, time for a raid. We're we clear, we're clear. I'm gonna attack these guys because I keep looking at the radar and I keep thinking that like the blue team's coming to get me or something. Alright. Siege tank there, I'm gonna take out one of these missile turrets. Fly away! Fly away! That was a little success, rather successful. All right, come at me, bros! Ha ha! Ha ha! You suck! All right, we can hit these guys. Cause they're sitting ducks. Okay, we got like three that are about dead. Okay, so take you out, take you out, you, 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 you. Oh, I didn't mean to select you. Okay, yeah, you two. Then I'll send you three down there to go heal. You were the one accidentally selected, so we lost three. So I'll add in three more. That. Get that. Haha. -ha. Oops, siege tank. Don't even think about it. Damn that <laughs> that building is just taking a beating. Come hither, my mutas. We have work to do. I guess that means I can move. It's my furthest one down. You. Crap, I can't really tell if I actually moved up. Okay, yeah. I want to kind of have him in like a little zigzag formation. Actually, I'm moving you over. I'm moving you upwards. That'll do. Control one. All back. All back. Okay, you guys move forward, and now we'll fly again. Oh, hello! Crap, crap. Come at me, bro. Okay, walk back.
Crap. Take out the siege tanks. Alright. Okay, they're shredding me up. How are you guys coming along? Somewhat nicely. You're good enough. Alright, so I have to try an indirect approach. Damn, they took out like five of my guys. Not bad, Terran Dominion, not bad. Don't worry, the main course is coming up. Look at that. Go ahead and get that. Oh, I see people's coming. No, it's just Marines running around being stupid. That. Oh yeah, I might want to pull you back. Yeah, I can pull you two forward. Who's the weakest one here? You. By the way, tag team. Oh no, I'm short one. So you two just kind of chill back there and heal up. I need to get about. Yeah, let's go ahead and get three more overloads. Overloads. Wait for that one guy to get done. Ooh, my building's getting healed up. Someone. Oh, wait, no, no never mind. <laughs> Still kind of weak. Still, it is above, uh, just slightly above 50%. Just slightly. Okay, get out of there, get out of there, before you get sliced and diced up. God, they got a lot of fucking marines. They got a lot, a lot of marines. Oh crap. Fly away. Come on, come at me. Yeah, I thought you would. Fall back. And attack. Alright, our little attacks are just not going too well. So I have you guys fly back. Pretty much all together. Okay, my overloads can move fast. Let's give them improved sight. Now, the problem with Hydralis is that they take up a crap ton of space. So, um, let's get three more. Ooh, lovely sounds. Go over there. Okay, never mind. Alright, let's go up here. Uh, I'm gonna have to separate them. Alright, once it can, over there. Once it can't, over there. You only got one guy in you. That's what she said. Alright, I don't need you guys. Haha, <laughs> you can't see me now. Hydras. Get that. Alright, 
And I'll bring these guys along because it won't hurt to have a little bit of air support. Alright, we have exactly 12. Alright, you guys get up here. And then we'll begin the assault. It's okay if this fails because I do have enough for another one. Oh, come on. I know there's one of them that's... Okay, I was going to say. Alright, so you'll be control group 2. Control group 1. Make sure the landing is clear. And what I'm going to have to do is have my mutas take out... Holy crap! Okay. Oh, a wise guy. Might need to try a different approach. So... So you guys don't get attacked in the middle of the freaking area. Yep. Thank you, computer. I completely knew that. Alright. Take that out. Oh crap, now oh, they're really pouring in. Alright, but I did exactly what I wanted to do. Go my minions! Overlords, go take a shit on their base. Oh crap, kill that one. Ooh, bloody. Oh, we didn't unload everybody. Holy crap, look at all the fucking... Get out of there, guys. Get out of there. Well, that was, other, that was an otherwise successful landing. No, just kill him. Holy crap. Get out of there. Get out of there. Okay, get back in there. Kind of rush in. Granted, I uh, yeah, I don't need them, but still, it'll make things go by quicker. They're not, no, they're not making any tanks. The way you know is the little arrows will be bleeping. They are making more marines. Let's put a stop to that. Crap. This wasn't a too terribly bad emission. Oh, they're making stuff out or now. That's right. Run away. Aww. you must stay and relocate the chrysalis to a more secure location. Dagoth shall deal with the remaining Terran forces. Lame. Fine. I'll do 
was just sad. Just I was having fun. I know we took a crap ton of casualties. Yeah, still killed more than we lost, which is a plus. But yeah, I mean that's pretty much how I do that mission. Though, though nor normally that landing I do, that first one, usually I take out a little bit of stuff, but yeah, it doesn't usually go that well. I usually have to do a second landing just because I've lost too much from the first one. Yeah, they go crazy with those siege tanks, so mutas, they're the way to go. Oh, and I lost no buildings to boot. So, I will see you all soon.